May 7th, we're in El Salvador International Airport, and this aircraft comes streaking in here. You can see it's leaving fire and flames as it's sparking down the runway, trying to slow down. There was two on board. They had landing gear malfunction, and it does not look like they are slowing down, and there's a lot of flames in their wake, as you can see. Now it looks like they're finally uh, losing some steam, and there's some fireballs there. Possible maybe fuel leaks. Maybe they release some type of uh, fuel tanks. But uh, it was this aircraft here, a Cessna A37 Dragonfly from the Salvadorian Air Force. If any of you are familiar with this aircraft, this is what it ended up looking like. Pretty sad. I believe this is a, probably a pretty rare aircraft developed in 1963. And there you can see the fuel tanks that were there. Possibly that's what those fireballs were. Maybe they released them. Um, as they came skidding in, but quite some damage here. Let's go back to the scene. So ARF's going to go ahead and respond. You're dealing with a military aircraft, so you definitely want to try coming at a 45. You don't want to, you don't know if there's missiles or things like that. You don't want to be directly in front of that, especially when the aircraft's on fire. So they're going to keep their distance there, pump and roll, and try to uh, go ahead and put out a large number of the fire with those turrets at a distance stay safe and there was those two on board so hopefully they got out hard to see from the picture but they're definitely using their roof turrets at the moment and looking at that picture they did use foam at some point here so here now they're going to go ahead and pull hand lines now that they you can see most of it is out and you can see that white foam all on the ground there um, so they're going to go ahead and get a closer look uh, with their hand lines and get these little spot fires out and uh, dig through that aircraft and, and really make sure they get everything. Uh, good to use hand lines, agent conservation, and I like how they are backing themselves up with the turrets and making sure that these guys are safe on the ground. So here you can see the aircraft. So this CEPA, um, that's the uh, Autonomous uh, executive airport commission so i believe they cover the the ports and airports and railways um in uh, el salvador and there you can see they got everybody out there helping to put it out foam everywhere and there's that aircraft they're gonna go ahead and take that aircraft uh, off the runway but very interesting one uh first time i've seen these these dragonflies i know about Bron blanco lirio went went over it um, but thanks for watching. This is our forum. I'll see you guys next time.